Hello everybody, it's Anna, the Switch Orchid Hoarder. I am here at the, my, in my bedroom in my orchid corner here. Um, I was showing you a project that I got inspired by Danny's uh, Orchid Journey. Yeah, Danny's Orchid Journey channel in uh, on YouTube. And uh, I have some rescue Catalayas that have been rescues for a very long time. I have, let's see here, this piece with the plastic bag on it. That is a no ID. That's the same as this one. This one took off after a while. Lots of good roots, uh, new growth and so on. But this one never took off. A few roots that look like they didn't want to belong to this world. Um, and so uh, I figured I tried Danny, uh, Danny's um, setup. Uh, I have a clay pot. I have some river rock in the bottom. A thick layer of sphagnum moss. And a plastic bag. I also have uh, orchid uh, uh, cattleya. Portanera um, that I bought, <coughs> excuse me, that I bought uh, from Germany uh, in June 2018 that refuses to uh, put out roots. Um, and uh, I have to try something new now to see if the roots will come. Um, as Danny said, uh, uh, I open these bags once a day for about an hour to let some air in, and uh, we'll see if they if they take off or not. And I just as well, oh, sorry, show you my mini mark has opened its second bud. I have another mini here, beautiful, and I figured, look at this one, Cycopsis papilio, look at them together, cute couple, <laughs> anyway, it's looking very really good together, <laughs> yeah. So, let's hope that uh, these Catleas start growing roots and start growing. Um, happy growing. I hope I see you soon. Bye-bye. Hey, doll.